Hi! This is just a look I did a few days ago and I put it on Instagram and some of you guys requested me to do a tutorial. So, mm, here it is. I basically tried to recreate um, AJ Crimson on New York Fashion Week. Originally I saw this look from Jean Franco. Is Franco is? I don't know. I'm sorry. Be sure to check out his channel. He is amazing. I love him. His YouTube name here. I tried to recreate it and I fell in love with it. So, we like to see how I got this look. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Keep on watching. First, I'm going to use Elf's Jumbo Eyeshadow Stick as a base. clean finger, I'm just going to go around the edges. This is going to act as the base for our shadows. I'm going to go in with the black eyeshadow, and then I'm going to pat it on my lids. Pat it on the lids, this way you get less fallout, because you don't want those fallouts, they suck. This will also help build up the color. And then eventually you sweep it. I'm just bringing it up to where the cre my socket is. And I'm just going to blend it from there. I'm going to go in with a fluffy brush. And then I'm going to go into this kind of reddish brown color. And mix it in with a little bit of this dark brown. Have a little bit more. And then I'm going to get some of this and some of this. And then I'm going to go right here. Blend it a little bit above the crease. It's gonna fade out into a reddish brown color. A little bit more of this red. Bringing the color slightly more up to this brow area. So, does that make sense? I hope. Hope that made sense. Pick up a little bit more black and Place it on the lids, just down here, because I lost some of that color. I'm going to take more of the black and just put it on the bottom lash line. Basically on that fold that you create when you smile or whatever. I'm going to take a clean pointed fluffy brush and basically blend this. I'm going to take a stiffer eyeshadow brush. I'm going to go with the highlight color and then put it under the brow bone and soften up the edges. Make it look more smoky. Also do the edges. Okay. I'm going to go with a small brush like this. Taking a goldish yellow color. Just put it in the inner corners of the eye. To intensify, I'm just going to take water and get the brush wet a little bit. Dip in the same shadow and then go back in. Shadow part is complete. Now I'm just going to line my eyes with the black liquid liner so this way it could help, you know, hide the lash band. So you won't even notice, girl. You won't even notice. You won't even notice. Oh my god, I fucked up. I'm gonna try to do this using my viewfinder and I'm totally screwing up right now. Apply your favorite mascara. Now you could just stop here and tight line and do your bottom waterline with black eyeliner or if you want an extra dramatic go in with false lashes. I'm gonna wear something like this and I do my lashes first before my eyeliner because my eyes tend to water and it's a hot mess. Okay, just a little tip if you know that happens to you. I'm just pinching it together this way my rear lashes will kind of combine and blend in with the false lashes. Yeah. OK, 
Yes, there you go. There you go. Now, I'm just gonna go with the brow tint. Darken up my brows just a little bit. Just poquito, just a tiny amount. Darken this up just a little bit. Just gonna go contour just a little bit. Or a lot. That's a lot, so I'm gonna do a lot. I guess. Sure that blends. I'll take some of the blush. Go on right here. I always like to tone down my lips with a nude lipstick, so that. And that's pretty much it. That's pretty much the look I did for Instagram. And here it is. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Follow me on Facebook and Instagram, and have a good day. Okay, bye.